Welcome to Not Just CAD with me, Sean Bryant, your resident techie geek and Autodesk expert elite. It's Fantastic Friday number 14, and in this particular video I'm going to be unboxing the new AMD GPUs that AMD have kindly provided to me to check out and look at their technical specifications. So, some shiny boxes from AMD have arrived. There was a knock on the door and these lovely shiny boxes were delivered. I must stress that AMD do provide me with this tech and hardware free of charge, full disclosure there. But what they do is they provide me with this technology to check it out, look at the technical specifications and have a look at which software applications it would be good to use these GPUs with. So as you can see, we've got the Radeon Pro W6800 and the Radeon Pro W6600 available to check out. So what I'm going to do is unbox them and let you know what's going on with them. So let's look at the AMD Radeon Pro W6600 first. As you can see, when you get it out of the box, it's got the usual AMD blue. It's got the usual superb AMD build quality as well. When you pick up one of these graphics cards, you can tell that they're well made and they're solid pieces of kit. It tells you exactly what you get in the box as well. So we've got eight gigabytes of memory on the W6600, hardware ray tracing support, and it's optimized for four displays. So it's a pretty cool workhorse card. Great for all your general use with your 2D and 3D CAD and potentially some BIM work maybe in Revit for example as well. And as you can see that lovely shiny blue that always looks nice when you get it out of the box as well. So let's take a look now at what the W6600 can provide. Let's have a look at the technical specs. It's got a more than adequate 8 gigabytes of fast memory for textures. It's got hardware ray tracing built on tech from games consoles with four outputs that support 8K ultra-wide HDR monitors. It's also got the PCIe 4 interface for fast throughput of data, so it's a quick card, it works quickly, which is twice as fast as the PCIe 3 spec, and AMD were the first to market with PCIe 4 for Pro GPUs. It has extensive Pro ISV certifications and as I said earlier it's superb for general CAD 2D and 3D work. Great for 3D modeling and a great CAD and BIM workhorse at low cost. Great for AutoCAD and Revit. Other products that you could use it with are Inventor and 3D Studio Max. Let's take a look now at the AMD Radeon Pro W6800. Again this one comes in the box as you can see the nice shiny AMD blue but when you get this W6800 out of the box it's a much bigger heftier GPU it's about twice the thickness of the W6600 and it's a really heavy GPU it's got a bit of weight to it and you can see that it's got a meaty 32 gigabytes of memory again it's got the hardware ray tracing but it's optimized for six displays why would you need six displays we ask ourselves well, I'd love six displays. That would be fantastic, wouldn't it? I normally run two with most of my AMD cards that I'm working with. But this is a really super duper card and you can work with many, many displays. And again, those displays are that 8K compatible. So let's take a look now at the specs for the W6800. Again, it's got that incredible 32 gigabytes of memory for textures. It's got the hardware ray tracing built on the tech from the games, like the W6600 has. But it's got six outputs that support 8K monitors. What a fantastic thought. And it runs with the PCIe 4 interface for that fast throughput of data, just like the W6600 does, which is twice as fast as PCIe 3. Again, it's got those extensive Pro ISV certifications. And it's superb for 3D modeling, architectural visualization and rendering, with applications ranging from AutoCAD up to Maya and Unreal Engine. This has been a CAD FM Consultants Not Just CAD video. Not Just CAD is owned by CAD FM Consultants Limited and all rights are reserved. All trademarks, copyrights and logos belong to their respective owners.